what's up guys this is steel gamer and today we are gonna be playing some more minecraft on my server so yeah I, I think somebody's definitely been joining because that block there was broken earlier today so yeah whoever's joining quit breaking blocks and actually do something even though I haven't released any of my videos yet once today Oh yeah, I forgot last episode, because I was so excited about diamonds, to show you guys this, the finished support beams. Now, we did have to f uh, destroy my um, wheat farm, but luckily my little hidey area still is alive. See, I was able to keep it around. Somebody had it open. Do I still have all my diamonds? Hang on. Five diamonds, yes. I'm a pickaxe. Fifty-two obsidian. Alright, we're alright. I thought somebody might have stolen something from me. You guys know how I am about that. Alright. So yeah, let's get inside. In this episode, we are going to be working on the foundation and maybe even finishing my main shop. And probably starting up a sugarcane farm. In fact, why don't I make my shop um, something? Well, I can't work in this lag. Like, every time I record, the server decides to start lagging. <coughs> Wait, do I have any lag commands? Like, lag? Nope. Alright. Alright, guys, so... I will start out on the foundation just because I can't stand this lag. Um, because look, every time I turn around, I'm so slow. Oh, whatever. Let's go. Alright, so first of all, let's start clearing out this area for a little flat area. And making sure it's. See, that's what lag causes. <laughs> This will be my main shop. My house will be, um... This was originally the mountain I thought, hey, why don't I build a house on top of? But I've decided that... Ugh, I hate this stupid antivirus. It, that ad always comes up. And I know it's not a virus, because it's antivirus. I think. on stupid lag. So yeah, my main shop is gonna have a little bit of stuff available. Like, um... Hang on, what should I have in my shop? Sorry that I'm... Hang on. I'll clear out this land because I cannot stand every five seconds that I move the screen freezing. This program stinks. I'm sorry, guys. It's just when you're trying to get something done as fast as possible because you have something in the morning. Quit it! Alright, I will be right back. I can't stand this. I can't stand this. Be right back, guys. Alright, guys, so we are back, and so is the lag. And, um... <laughs> I dug out a flat area, so now we're gonna go get our building materials. Oak wood, over there, and, um, cobblestone, or stone bricks, actually, would be great. So, yeah, let's put... Let's just get a few stacks of cobble. Put that, that, that. This is, like, my junk chest, where if people steal from me, I'll be mad, but I won't kick them. Type thing. I wouldn't kick my friend, I would just be really mad and kill them. <laughs> if they stole something from me. Do I have any wheat down there? Hang on. We need to set up a good quality farm. That's probably what I'll do next episode.
I'm sorry, what am I doing again? Oh yeah, I need oak wood. <laughs> what don't we need? What is an important oak sapling important? Bye bush. Oak saplings are important, so I will plant them. And then make space for some oak logs. I really like that road. I will talk to my friends and tell them about my deal with the, um, thingy. Oh yeah, I have five diamonds now, guys, because I went mining again. This time I did something called branch mining, where I mined in a different direction from that tunnel, and I found diamonds within, like, 30 blocks. I would ride my horse, but nah. Just because I don't really like riding my horse because it puts me and the horse in danger when I'm the driver. <laughs> I'd much rather have a cricket driving the car than me, or the horse. Especially with this lag, it's like lag in the driver's eyes. Pull over. We're gonna need a lot of logs because we're not just using planks, we're also using logs. Now, of course, we can't build where the road is gonna go, says the law that I created like five minutes ago. So, yeah, I'm gonna need a lot of space, but I can't build it in like the center where I would normally build it. And I'm, I'm thinking maybe I should build it my, ho my house farther, far away. Because I have enough iron and gold to build a railroad system to my house. From the shop and stuff. I don't know why nobody has joined today. They always join, like, right after I leave and, like, break blocks that aren't theirs. <laughs> Alright, here we go, we're at 40. 40 wood. That's plenty. <coughs> Look at that horse. Ooh, that looks like a great horse. I think he was in the same pack as my horse. Hang on. Yeah, looks like it, because they both look the same. Alright guys, so I will start building it, just because, um, I don't really want to waste time, I want to get this done quickly. So yeah, I'll be right back. Alright guys, so we are back. Just let me grab that. And let me show you guys what I've done so far. right here. I'm glad I kept those two rose bushes. I hear a baby zombie. This is not the time to lag. Where are you? Where are you? It's gonna hit me in a second. I know it. Baby zombies, I don't think, burn up. So yeah, I'm dead. Um, so yeah, I placed a crafting to- yep, here we go. Um, let's make some chests. And some stairs. So yeah, 16 chests. So here. So here will be the payment chest. And then offer chest. Offer chest. Another payment chest. Right. Here, I hope I have enough iron. Then we have four extra chests. So yay. Let's just stick that in there. This is not my house, guys. Sorry. You know what? We could have another offer chest. 
There we go. So yeah, I think what I should do is put hoppers here. So that people can put in what they have to pay. We also have to dig out this room. So it doesn't really matter that I'm breaking stuff. First of all, I'm going to put in slaps, because mobs can't spawn on slaps, which is fantastic. I don't know if that's a glitch or what, but it's amazing. Oh, come on. So yeah guys, I think what I'll do is make a few furnaces and fill in uh, stone brick slabs. So yeah, I'll be right back. Alright, so while this stuff is cooking, why don't we go um, make a little sugarcane farm because I have enough diamonds now to make an enchanting table. And I think, I don't know what I should enchant first. Should I enchant a bow and get infinity possibly with a level 30? Or should I enchant a sword, a, make a diamond sword, or make a diamond pick? I don't know. Because if I enchant a diamond pick and get fortune and or silk touch, that would be fantastic. But I kind of want an infinity bow. So yeah, let me get my stock of in, uh, sugar cane. And go start. on the community sugarcane farm. So on this side can be... What is that? Farms. Or one big farm with everything in it. Farm. I don't know why. I have to label stuff when people aren't joining. I'm sure they'll join eventually, though. Alright, here we go. Now, do we have enough? Yep, we have a bucket. Alright, perfect. Now I'm just gonna make a bunch of cobble walls to surround the farm. Sorry guys, um, just had to make that one even. 32 times 6 should equal, yep, alright. Plus more, so yeah. Wow, that's a lot. That's probably enough. So first, let's just start digging out the road, and when I say that, I mean just flattening some space for it. So yeah, let's make the farm here-ish. So let's see. The road would go like this. Sorry, that is the other part of the road. In fact, why don't we just... Alright guys, I will be right back. I will continue working on this, and I will give you guys a progress report. Be right back. So we are back. That might have been cut off. So, alright guys, we are back. Um, I'm just going to record really fast. I have dinner in a minute. I just wanted to show enchanting. There's a spider. I hear it. But I got an enchanting room set up. Use the sugarcane farm a bit. So let's just do this seven times like Brax vs. Gaming told me to do. Here, 
right, let's do it one more. I want it to be... Yep. Here we go. Silk Touch! <gasps> oh, sweet. Alright, guys. So, yeah. Um, I have to eat dinner. But that's... Oh, come on, dude. You, are you really... Oh, okay. I see how it is. Thank you. Yep. We just got Silk Touch, guys. That's... Wow. Fantastic. I know I said I'd be enchanting a bow, but I changed my mind because I wanted to get fortune for mining, but I'm definitely alright with that. Let's just go put it in our secret area. There's the little sugar cane farm. I, I have been doing a lot. Like, I have everything set up in the shop, and I had an idea the other day. One, I could sell arrows in my shop for overpriced, because... Everybody, I, nobody else on the server knows where the skeleton spawner is. So what I could do is be mean and tell people they can't use it, or no, th that they can, that they have to buy arrows, and I'm not going to tell them where it's hidden. Or number two, I can make a membership. You have to buy a membership card. All right, so yeah, I'm going to get another uh, enough to go to level 30 again, and then we'll enchant, and I'll be back, just because. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna stay outside and kill a few mobs for a while. Just because, or go mining. Oh yeah, we have nine diamonds now because I have been mining a lot, which is one of the reasons why I want fortune. So when I find diamonds, I don't really get one. I get like three or four from one diamond. Yeah, that's a little dark. So, uh, yeah, um, let me just show you guys what I've done so far, then we can wrap up and I'll get level 30 and stuff. So, here's the sugar cane farm, really productive, don't really need it anymore. And here's the cow farm. Oh, I just realized something that I wanted to do. Let's go make, hang on, let me go do the counting and run from these guys. Of course, there's one up here. How many arrows? Zero. Right. Alright, so let's go up here. Kill him. So, and then open this door. I installed that pressure plate system myself. Okay, so here are the setups I have. First, let's go here. So it tells you the item and the price. Now, if people don't put the price in the payment chest, I'm going to set up a system that actually checks to make sure they've paid, but I'm hoping that I can trust people on this server not to, not to steal from me. But if peop if that is the case, I will start to, I will set up a system. Um, here's a saddle chest. This price for this saddle is one stack of iron or three diamonds. I thought it could be cheaper because, um, a saddle, because, um, because I thought saddles could be made, so I went up online and it, currently you can't make them, but apparently in the snapshot you can fish them out of water. But here we have some iron horse armor for 32 iron, not a bad price. Here we have redstone and block and lapis block because I had way too much um, redstone and lapis so I made some blocks that's what's left and I I've mined a little uh, here's full leather armor because I had too much leather look at this wow I just thought of an idea that we can make more leather <laughs> armor Oh no. Okay. We only have one leather. Hang on, let's go kill a cow. Get some leather. I guess I'll set up the system I was planning on setting up this episode, next episode. Or I'll set it up and show you guys just because it takes too long. So yeah, I'm not going to breed them just because they're a little bit overpopulated anyway. And I have 30 meat. Two. 
four. Okay, and there's a skeleton currently shooting at me. I have no idea which way's out. Shoot. Yeah, shoot my cow. Die. There we go. Hang on. This system isn't exactly the best because cows can escape, but it's alright. Alright, let's get that. Uh, get this for that. I was just doing something earlier. That is the old system, as you guys probably already knew. So yeah, I know how to set up a system that will actually check to make sure they have like a certain thing, like a gold block membership card, or, or an iron block membership card, and it actually is written the same way. And, yeah, that's going to be great. Hang on. A full other armor, right. So, yeah, now we have exactly enough leather to make... Or, we have exactly full leather armor, again. Sweet. And, um, here is my offer. Ten iron for four stacks of oak logs, just because I need to decorate the mine. So that's kind of... I might change that to twenty, it's just I'm not sure. So yeah, I have my ten iron right there. Um, here is items, slime balls, and ender pearls. I have been mining a little bit of slime and um, ender pearls. Uh, the price for a slime ball is fifteen... Uh, iron per stack, and then the price for an ender pearl is 20 iron per pearl. Um, here is slabs, price uh, 10 pieces of iron per stack. So I already I currently have that up because I had enough wooden stuff to make that. Here I have iron bars just because I have way too many iron bars, and I set that up there. I made it more so that it could be a stack. Um, here we have cobblestone walls, because I've made a little bit too many uh, cobblestone walls down there. So I have that for sale, and we have four stacks of those. So, four iron per stack. So that's a great way to make some iron. And what I'm going to set up is a little system to cover this up, so people can't just come down and steal my enchanting table, stuff like that. So yeah, that's great. We have silk touch. We can get um, ice now. Which is great. We can start up a little ice farm and an ice shop. Except it would have been great if it were unbreaking. Alright. So yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a like. I will be combining it with the last video. It's been a few days for me since I recorded the first part. Just let's mine some more sugar cane just because um, I might need it for something else even though I can't really think of anything else that I might need it for. I could probably start a sugar cane shop or a sugar shop or something. But yeah, I talked to somebody today and they said that they want to build the hotel. So yeah, um, if they build that hotel, they get, what's it called, uh, iron. 64 iron, which is what I'm offering currently. Let me just get this last row. Ah, oh, 57 already. 58. Can I get a 59, 59, 59? Nope. Okay. So, yeah, let's end. Uh, why don't we end in front of my shop? <laughs> and I actually went a little bit over there. There's an Archaea biome, also a dark oak forest. Of course, there's a zombie here. Alright, so yeah guys, if you enjoyed this video, uh, make sure these guys shut up. Um, make sure you give it a like. Uh, make sure you comment about what I should enchant next, even though I've already decided it's a uh, uh, pickaxe. Even though you want me to, even if you want me to enchant a sword, no, I want a pickaxe, because if I get fortune, that'll be fantastic. Alright, so yeah guys, uh, later. Let me just make a screenshot for the thumbnail, and later.